Hello everyone, this is Linda. In this video, I'm sharing with you all what I'm doing because I saw a squash vine boar around my squash. And when I pulled the leaves back from my squash, yeah, y'all, I saw this huge hole in the bottom of my squash. Now, usually, I would, uh, when my plants get a little bigger, I usually go out and foil paper everything, all of my squash. But this year, I didn't do it. <laughs> yeah. And, yeah, this is what happens when <gasps> you don't do it. <laughs> so... Uh, there is there was this big hole in uh, one of my squash and uh, so this is a procedure that I use to I'm sorry <laughs> it's late in the evening y'all I'm so tired but this is what I do to try and find out first if the bug have laid an egg in the plant and two I want to get it out if it's there right so this is what i've done now i had some problems because the sun was like right there i tried to hook up some stuff so i could block the sun then the wind blew knock it over but anyway guys listen i hope uh this helps and i will definitely keep you all informed updated on uh what happened to uh, what happens to this uh, to this plant? All right, guys. I hope you all enjoy. All right, guys. On with surgery. <laughs> I hope you can see this because this is the part where I'm working from. I'm gonna turn on um, my little speaker here, so hopefully um, it will pick up my voice. Now the bees want to come around. <laughs> uh, okay, I know it's on now. All right, let's see if it's on. It's on. Okay. What are you saying, baby? But anyway, um, as I said earlier today, I saw a vine borer uh, beetle this morning when I was watering my plants. Now, these are the things I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use some, it's hard for me to see because of, this is just aluminum foil. I'm gonna use some, I can't see you. Okay, right there. Tweezers, these are tweezers. And I'm gonna use my friendly, friendly, friendly Dollar Tree multi-purpose knife yay Dollar Tree <laughs> yes 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 I hear you my baby I hear you mm-hmm but anyway so I'm gonna look into this plant and see if this uh, um, I hope I got it close enough for you guys to see to see if there is a larvae in here or not. So I'm gonna cut this plant a little just to see if I see it. And hopefully I don't hurt this plant. So I cut it going upwards first. And, um, hmm. I think, um, I don't know what that is. Let's see. What did I do with the tweezers that fast, Lord? Oh, man. Hold on. 
I don't know what I did with them, y'all. But, um, I think what I'm going to do is after I complete this, I'm going to put some compost in her. I don't know what this is. Wait, let me see if you all could see that. I'm trying to get it focused because I really can't see the camera. All right. So I don't know what that is, but uh, yeah. I'm going to save it on the side just so I can investigate it a little more. Now I'm going to cut the bottom part a little bit. Just a little and see what I see here. This don't look okay, I got it the wrong way. I have to match the wrong way. Now there is an extra hole down there. So I'm gonna go a little bit further. Y'all just call me Dr. Linda. <laughs> oh God, I find myself cutting into most, many of my plants. Oh, this is to stop the, the lighting and everything going crazy. Just stay there, baby. Just stay there. Okay. All right, y'all all right? All right. Okay, y'all. So, um, I wanted to show you all when I close this plant up, I'm going to put compost in her. But what I did was I just kind of went at the bottom of this plant and went somewhat down in the dirt. <coughs> I'm sorry. And um, I um, put this foil around even deep into the, the earth so it could be really protected from this bug <laughs> yeah so now I'm just gonna put some compost in it and then I'm gonna close it up really really good and it's just using foil paper that's all and this foil paper is definitely gonna protect her because nope the bug will not be able to get into the plant no no, she won't be able to get in. I have another piece somewhere. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, this will keep this plant protected. And um, hopefully, hopefully, this plant will continue to grow and give uh, lots and lots of fruits. And you definitely want to get all around this plant really, really, really well. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh, sorry about that. Everybody want to get in a shot, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. But all right, guys, so hopefully uh, I got that bug out, that egg out. It looked gross. Uh, I think it was that was a part of it. So hopefully we got it. Now if I could just put everything back where it was, I'd be happy. <laughs> but uh, everything over here is looking really good. I got some watermelons and I guess some here. Let's see where I saw that melon. 
right there. Yeah. And uh, I see one over here somewhere. But anyway, you know, you know, they got melons. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I hope you all have a, a great day. I hope this will help someone. And I will definitely give you updates on what's going on with these uh, these babies. And yeah, that uh, that beetle I saw this morning. Yeah, I won't see her again. Not her. Hmm. <laughs> All right, guys. Y'all have a great day. Later, y'all.